triads going up the neck. This time we're just going to use a D chord, and just like last time, we're going to be using the same chord, a D major, the whole way up. It'll always have the same name, it just will have a different position each time. So we'll start with the D that we know and love. The next one up is going to be on the 5th fret on your high E string, and the 7th fret on your B and G. Come so. Our last one, we're going to move up to the 10th fret on the E string and B string, so I'm barring those with my index finger. I'm going to play the 11th fret on the G string. This one is also a little bit tough, but it's really reminiscent of the F chord shape. We're just not having that ring finger on there. The root note's just on your high E string. Then we start over on the 14th and 15th fret with the regular D shape. It just crammed in there really tight. This is major triads up the neck. We're going to start with just a D chord and we'll be doing the exact same chord the whole way up the neck. I wish I could talk.